Hey, what is up guys? It is Pro here. So today I am going to be doing a tutorial on this cannon right here. My corner cannon. I've been getting some requests wanting people to show me how to make it uh, and you know all that good stuff. So I've got this one set up. We're just gonna fire this one and then we'll go right there and we will build it. So here we go. And it'll go out quite a ways. Obviously you can add more power, you can add more delay. Uh, we'll get into that here in just a minute. So we're gonna come over here and let's grab these materials that I have. We're gonna need glass, slabs, your choice of a building block, button, dispenser, redstone torch, comparator, repeater, and redstone. All right, so to get started, I usually make the bottom frame. So we'll come out like this. Make a little arrow right there, the four block. And we'll put two there. And then you'll take your building blocks. Go two here. Two here. Three here. And same on this side. So you have what looks like that. And then you'll put one block right there. So that's that's main, the main frame here. Let's not forget that. <clears throat> Alright. So from there, we're going to place some dispensers. So you'll place these two here. For your compression, you'll come up here. You place one, two, and this all depends on how much power you, how much power you want, or how far you are shooting. I usually, uh, I usually go four on each side. That, that'll usually do the job. But if you need more, then obviously you can add more. Then we'll take our glass. We'll cover this up. Throw it up here, just like so. Oh, one thing I need is a water bucket. Let's throw a water bucket here. Throw water here. We'll get that glass back and we will cover that up. All right. So that's how that's the that's the main part of the cannon. So now we'll work on the delay for the scatter. So what we'll do is we'll come up one here. We'll go up one more. And then we'll go across one, two, three. So you got four across. And one, two, three, four. So you have five across. And you'll bring this all the way over till you meet this. Now when you meet this, you're gonna go out one. And then the, the next one back, you'll go out one. So you got a little platform here. And you go up one. And then one more. You'll put one in this corner. This is where you'll put your scatter. So you'll put one here, one here. We got to put a block here. Throw one down there, and one there. And that is how you set up the scatter. <clears throat> now, to wire it, wire this part. You're going to throw your redstone here. Come up to here. Throw two repeaters. Throw three repeaters two, three, four repeaters, then your comparator. And this is why you had to make that little platform. And then run your redstone up here and all the way around. And that is your scatter. And then with these repeaters, there's nine repeaters right here. This is the least amount of repeaters that you can have. You have any less, even <clears throat> one tick less on any of these repeaters your TNT will fall too early and you have a possibility of blowing up your cannon. So nine repeaters minimum for your scatter. You can add more. I think you can add three, three more repeaters, four repeaters, and you should be fine. I think at four is when it starts to not work correctly. So here we're gonna come out on here break that one we gotta come out one two three and then one block here we'll bring this out to there 
and we'll do the same thing right up here. All right, and then you're going to take your slabs. You're going to throw one on each of those. Then you're going to get your blocks. You place one there, and then put a slab on the bottom of it, and break that block. You place one, put a slab, break that block. And you'll do the same thing right there. All right. And then you'll run your redstone up this, and all the way down. And then right here, you're going to throw three repeaters on full ticks, just like that. And then you'll take your redstone torch, throw them on there, take your button, put it right there, and you are done. That is all there is to this cannon. Very simple, very easy to set up. Now I'm going to put TNT in it, so once I get that done, I will see you guys in just a second. Alright, so we are back, and I've gotten this filled up with TNT, so now I'm going to shoot it to show you guys that it works. So here we go. Go push the button. And there it goes. And that will be it for this tutorial. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments. I will try and answer as many of them as I can. And thank you guys for watching. Have a good day. Yeah.